Hello and welcome to the Thank channel. You, you Summer adventures continue. David, stop kicking rocks, dude. Hold on, sis. Okay. We're gonna remove these. You wanna try, sis? Hold snuggles just for a second. Oh, look at you. You got it. Hopefully I haven't permanently ruined my bumper because I took so long to take this off. Not my bumper, but my front lip. Need help, baby? Oh, you got it. Look, so easy a five-year-old can do it. Maybe. Good job, sis. Oh, she's almost got it. It's attached to the bottom. Okay, let me look. Okay. Got it. Oh. I can do. I can do. Good the job, other. sis. Look at you. Then hold on. Oh no. It's. Okay, let me figure out how it's attached. Right in it. Okay, watch out. Watch out. Move. I can feel those screws. They're screws? Yeah. No, it just pops out. Ah, maybe not. Okay, hold on. David, wait, buddy. Okay, let's see what we got here, guys. Oh, I need like a... I think I just need a flathead screwdriver to... Oh, wait, to be removed by dealer. See, those are supposed to be removed by the dealer. Oh. All right. We're gonna have to film this later. We're gonna have to do a part two because I need a flathead screwdriver. Watch your fingers. There we go. Okay, we're gonna remove those later. I, I wanted to show how easy these kids get in the car. Pick up Snuggles. Okay, step one, open the car. Okay, get in however you guys want. However you normally do. Yeah, we have to get a flower. No, baby, that's a weed. Get in the car. Maybe when we get back. I don't, maybe when we get back. I don't want it in my car. Let's go. Good job. She's going to strap herself in and then I'm going to go around and strap him in. Watch your feetsies. Dunzo. Really? Not that hard at all. Okay. My big dunzo was waiting. Oh, was it? Put your arm in the car. Right there. All right, let's get you buckled in. Okay. You're supposed to put your arms through. I found my my dunzo right there. Oh, your daddy drove last. No wonder. Okay, arm. Why isn't your arm through, dude? Sit. There you go. Okay, dude, sit up. There we go. Mommy. Yes. Do your top buckle. Perfect. And then she's going to get herself buckled in. Can I, can you record that? And I'm gonna go start the car, okay? okay. Do a cold start. Good job, sis. And he got himself top buckled. Hey, baby, fix your chest clip. Pull it up. Oh, perfect. Fix yours too, baby. Oh, when you're done. Sorry. Good job. Okay. All right, let's do a cold start. It's nice and loud outside. Shopping at Toys R Us because someone has 
birthday money from September and it's June and a little bit of tooth fairy money and someone else move your head someone else is doing a great job potty training so and look yeah look at those teeth so we're just now gonna go spend that money and they're gonna have a blast it's kind of sad that Toys R Us is closing I remember being a kid and going through the Toys R Us catalog and circling stuff I wanted and and now they're gonna close, but everything is supposed to be 80% off. So hopefully the kids will get some good stuff with their money. A few it's quirks. It's still closed. It's still closed. Yeah, we have to wait 10 minutes. A few quirks about the Challenger that I've noticed that I wish were a little different. First, no memory seats. So when David drives the car, I then have to remember how it was to set my seat back up, which I'm just used to memory seats and it's not that big of a deal, but it's just odd. <laughs> They don't, my car also does not have lane keep assist, which also not the end of the world. The pilot didn't have lane keep assist, but it would be a nice option on such a nice car. The adaptive cruise control is different than David's. I was used to his and it, it will only go down to a certain mile per hour. I want to say 15 and then it turns it off. It, you don't have to be stopped for a certain amount of time, which is how David's works. So that's another oddity. The other thing is on the music, you can say that something is a favorite like favorite song but i don't really know what to do from there so that's a little bit different i just don't know my my stuff yet so my kids have zero patience and we're gonna go stand by the door because they can't wait for it to open hold hands good little people Time says 10 o'clock, but the kids are determined. You want to try the door? Pretty sure it's not open yet. See if it opens. Nope. Okay, we got to wait. I told you. 10 minutes. Final four days. There you go. Are you just so excited? I want to buy this one. <gasps> okay, that's fine. Okay. Yeah. Huh? Those are only $2 and each. Okay, let's go see what else you guys want. Woo! Oh no, I, I understand. Oh, what is this? Bust a boat dance game? Do you want a dance game? Okay. Wow. Okay. Guys, there's a whole store. Okay, David, David. Let me see what it is. Hold on, hold on. No, buddy, you're not going to like that. Go put that back. David, okay, you're gonna run out of money real fast. Watch out, dude. Look how sad is this. Okay. So I guess we're gonna get this for Sydney. Well, you guys are going to share with each other. Yeah. You buy way more toys than me already. So now we got the WWE. David, put these up there too, buddy. Unless nobody's coming in. There you go. You should always ask for say, hey. All right. Don't need me. Watch out, buddy. Oops, sorry. Me, I'll do with the cards. Work tomorrow? I didn't find that much because it's not I know that was crazy. Something else I'm not crazy about on the car, it doesn't have lane departure but also doesn't have the front parking assist so I don't know when I'm too close to things 
which just means I end up parking really far back instead of close to things because I don't know where I'm supposed to park and I don't want to ruin my front spoiler but do you guys still like my car yeah and look this is what that I got Rainbow. yay the the windows also do not do auto roll up they act like they do they do auto down but you do up and they stop super irritating I really like being able to just pull the button and the handle, the window goes up. So the next thing I need to figure out is what mod am I gonna do? I'm thinking mid muffler delete, but I need some input. What is gonna be a nice, easy first mod for me to do that is not gonna cost a ton and is just going to be something that I can go get done. I know the mid muffler delete I'm gonna have to go and do, but that might be a good one because I really do want the car to be a little bit louder so what are your guys' ideas? Do I tent the windows? Give me give me some ideas. I'm really, really looking for what I want to do with this car. I haven't haven't done anything yet and I'm ready. Okay, this is their final haul. Look at all that. Alright, got screwdriver. Let's see if we can get these bumpers off. Let's see if I can show you guys. How hot is the ground? Okay. These need to come out. So let's see if we can do this. Whoa. This is scaring me. Oh, those things are in so tight. Oh my great goodness. See if we can do it this way. There we go. Sorry about that. Woo. One off. Try this again. Okay, let's do this. Oh, come on. Done. Got him off. Woo. Look at that now. Now it needs to be cleaned. But that's just dirt. Okay, so that's one other, that's one other thing that's weird is you have to open the doors in a very specific way or they don't open. Like if your hand is not perfectly aligned. I have low gas, so it will no longer give me a range. It just says fuel low. But I, I can't think of any other odd things about the car. I really, I really just like it. I mean, I love, honestly, everything else about it. That I guess having to cycle through all the menus to find what you want sometimes is a little, a little irritating. But other than that, I mean, I like, I like everything else. Good car. Still super happy with it. We had a busy, busy day, but this car does everything I need it to do constantly. So the kids and I, I haven't driven the Pilot. I mean, the one time when we got it washed, but the kids haven't been in it because there's no car seats. And it's summer and I am very lucky to be in education where I get to spend the summer with my kids. I get to spend approximately eight weeks off with them. We take them out of daycare and I enjoy the summer with them. So it's really nice, but we've been in this car constantly and really haven't had any problems. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.